Hello, children. This is, this is Ashley Wright with Pouring with Banger TV. Last Wednesday, students accepted awards at the ISM Showcase. This is Christina Emanuel with the story. Hi, I'm Christina Emanuel, and welcome to Vanguard TV. Last week, I interviewed some ISM students to see what the class is all about. ISM is basically a um, it's a year-long course which demonstrates your independent study topic, which is a topic that you either chose for fun or something you want to do in the future. And you research everything on that topic and you gain a mentor because it is independent study and mentorship. So for in the mentorship, the, your mentor, which is a professional in your field, help you gain um, perspectives on everything and helps you answer questions and basically gets you ready for final presentation, which is May and then showcase, which just happened yesterday in January. ISM stands for Independent Study and Mentorship. And it's basically a course where you get to uh, decide whatever field you want to study and you get to just uh, find a mentor and you get to be able to learn more about your, uh, your subject. ISM is an independent study and mentorship program. My topic is sports nutrition. At ISM, we gain professionalism skills through cold calling and attaining a mentor. I did journalism as a whole, which um, involves taking pictures, doing uh, writing articles, editing, and everything. And my mentor, who was the um, editor of the Dallas Morning News, she helped me edit all my articles and come up with ideas and all that. Uh, my topic is sports medicine, and I specifically looked at uh, hip injuries. Um, it's helped me learn uh, more about uh, communicating with professionals, and it's also helped me with learning more about just sports medicine in general. Um, I think the most important um, uh, life things that I gained were basically uh, calling people and having the confidence to speak to professionals because not a lot of people have the um, skills to call and I think um, building connections and talking to, my, talking to professionals were something that I gained. Yes, I do see sports nutrition as a possible career path for me because of ice and it has opened my eyes to the reality of it and the difference between a nutritionist and a dietitian. So I can definitely see my topic as being a potential career choice because of ISM. Thank you for watching. This has been Christina Emanuel with Vanguard TV. Hi Trailblazers, this is Mona Lane Santos reporting with the Vanguard TV. On January 12th, the Frisco Public Library held an event called Hack Your Career Day. Hack Your Career Day encompassed how to enhance your professional social media preference, resume, infographics, and interviewing skills. At the entrance, there was a variety of different booths showcasing colleges and universities which provided more detailed information about their campus. They gave insight on how to plan for the future and prepare for college with as many advantages as possible. Many different professionals came to present at the Frisco Public Library to give advice about how to handle your future career path. There were two tracks, which was the Work Smarter track held in the Council Chambers and Build Your Career track held in the McCollum Room. On the Work Smarter track, there were presentations such as Welcome and Goal Setting with Kevin Green, Career Transitions with Roxanne Varelli, Enhancing Your LinkedIn Profile with David Kinn, and Think Like an Entrepreneur with Aaron Smith. On the Build Your Career track, there were presentations such as Resume Creation and Editing with Kevin Green, Hack the Interview with Ann Anderson, and Personal Infographics Using Canva to Highlight Your Career Achievements with Cassie Wicklin. Alongside these sessions, you are able to take your headshots for LinkedIn on the third floor. This has been Mona Lane Santos reporting with the Vanguard TV. 3D modeling and animation is a class where you learn about Maya and do projects where you animate characters, model objects, and rig models. What we do in 3D modeling and animation is explore the principles, concepts, and methodologies associated with the creation of graphics, animation, and character design. The class gives you a tech and fine art credit. If you want to go into that as a career, then you can take a double block class at the CTE Center called Animation 1. 
Then you can move on to animation two, which is also double blocked at the CTE center. Some of the skills that I hope the students master in 3DMA this year are to use Photoshop and Maya to create animated multimedia, both in the uh, 2D and 3D uh, environments. 3D modeling and animation is a class at LTHS which any grade level can take. 3D modeling and animation can lead to a degree in animation and it could potentially work at big name studios like Pixar. This has been Zach Bernius from The Vanguard. Good afternoon, Trailblazers. Have you bought your yearbook yet? Our yearbook staff has been capturing moments since the first day of school with the clever theme of momentum. The deadline to buy your yearbook is February 1st. You can buy one at Jostens.com. Have a good day, y'all. I'm Alyssa Young with The Vanguard TV. Hi, I'm Master White and this is LT Trivia. The Screen Artist Guild Award will air this Sunday on TBS. The SAG Awards are an outstanding performances in film and television. Actors Christian Bale, Bradley Cooper, Ronnie Malek, Viggo Mortensen, and John David Washington all compete for the series outstanding performances in a male actor in a leading role. Which actor do you think will take home this award? To enter, use the QR code or go to www.lthsvanguard.com and click on LT Trivia. The winner will be selected from the correct answer submissions. Congratulations to Anae Trella and Ryan Darwin for winning our December trivia contest. They will each receive two free Annie's Concretes. Thank you for watching. Here are some highlights by the theater they play, Murder is a Game, shot and edited by Zachary Weiner.